Cop that, cop that, cop that, cop that, cop that. 40K on my chain, cop that. Sign the clothes on my brain, cop that. They think they my brain, cop that. Shooters go insane, pop that. 100 diamonds on the chain, rock that. I'm a monster in the game, lock that. The girls holler my name, jot that. No single on the way, no. I'm back in the kitchen with crack. crack. Supreme gave us gifts, man. Welcome to Sneaker Notes, man. I know it's been a long, long time, man. Life's been happening, man. But um, I'm finally going to get to the video of this big unhaul and all this street where I've been buying during this uh, whole epidemic thing going on. As you can see, we're not in the sneaker room. Because this is not a sneaker video. <laughs> Today I'm going to unhaul all the street where I've been buying lately. Um, the reason why I said it's every time to do it now is because I started wearing most of it. So we're going to start with Supreme Week 1. And as you can see, um, the Week 1 free accessory because these nice white gloves, which makes so much sense right now with the COVID situation going on. So, that was a good look, Supreme. The stickers include your regular box logo sticker and this nice dope um, jet going down that reads USAF. If you watch the channel, you know I usually do the Supreme accessories ASAP, but... This week one, I really wasn't feeling the accessory. Um, you know, half of the accessories is, a, is not needed, but I really didn't need this one. So I just went with the tees. So to top it off, this was the killer tee um, everybody was going for. Luckily, they just had it in so many colors. This right here is just Supreme Farrell Sanders tee. I always love that Supreme put the picture, whoever signed the Supreme logo on there. I mean, I missed out on a few, um, but to me, I got the ones that matter. I have the Gucci main one. I might pay resale for the Nas one. But today, this is the Farrell Sanders T, jazz player. So, that's one T I got from the week one Supreme drop. Second T, I mean, I thought it was really plain, even though the T is called Futura. I just still thought it was plain. But this is your Futura Supreme T. Oh, I didn't even know it had writing on the back. I'm kind of happy I got this T now. So the front reads Supreme and like that futuristic font. Looks like a, um, a marker. But the back reads Justice for All. If y'all can see that. And that's what I love about Supreme, man. They always, they always keep us first, man. And I appreciate that. You know, the COVID T. Next week, the Relief T comes out. Super dope, Supreme. And last but not least, the Supreme Week 1 Tees. I really didn't like this color too much, but I love the print. This is the Supreme Balloon Shirt. If you think Supreme is running out of ideas, you're so wrong, man. They have design on top of design on top of design. Nothing on the back of this one. But the uh, the balloon situation is dope. Okay, I want more look at that. Boom. So that's it for the week one a Supreme T drop. And again, shout out to Supreme. Let's go to these. I got these uh, two weeks, three weeks ago on release date. I know I'm coming to y'all late, but... Better late than never, man. And this right here, if you know, is your Nike Stussy collab. They've been collabing crazy this year. Um, I think about three pairs of sneakers. And now they finally came out with the clothing. And 
and now the slides. Let's take both of these out. You got you, you gotta love to see how the fresh slides. This fresh slides smell so good. So I mean nothing nothing too crazy. It's your regular Banasi or Banasa. Learn how to pronounce it. Nike slides. Which is Slissy Brandon. The reason why I went for this color is because my Jeep Wrangler is this color. And um, I don't know. I guess it would be cool to go to the beach one day with the doors off. I don't know, man. In the comment section below, let me know um, did you cop these Slissy slides? And let me know what did y'all cop from week one of the Supreme Drop. Like I told y'all, the accessories I really wasn't feeling, but um, it has some good stuff there. So let me know in that comment section below what did y'all cop. Again, these are the Stussy Slides. And speaking of slides, it's the What's On Foot segment. This is part of the video where you, the viewer, go down in that comment section below and let your boy know what you rocking on foot when you caught this video. Speaking of slides, today I got on my Lakers slides. We trying to close out the series. Uh, against Portland tonight, so um, I decided to throw the Stussy slides on. I mean, the uh, Lakers slides on. These are the Stussy slides. Alright, still reaching into the streetwear that I brought this month. This here is the Billie Eilish Takashi Murakami collection. I think I had these shirts in January or February. I'm sorry, I'm just showing you guys, man. But again, better late than never. I love how you and the glow pack, pack their shirts. Not no knock on Supreme with the regular plastic. But this plastic here is elite. So again, on the tag you have the regular UT for the you and the glow. Uh... Got your Marikami there. And I'm to be honest, I didn't know who Billie Eilish was until she did this collab with Marikami and then I looked her up. And I decided to go with the all white tee with the Marikami uh, all through the front. I mean, for the men with this collab, we rarely, rarely had things to choose from. The woman and kid shirts were dope, man. But I wasn't trying to really fit into a woman tee. I don't know how this part fits. <laughs> and the kid tee was definitely a no-no. But I did buy my son a colorful one with the flowers. You can see the bottom print. So yeah, this is the Marikami Uniqlo Billy Eilish collection. Here go Billy. Other than that, finally, I mean, if you're a fan of you broke before, you can't really tell what this is either way. Could be it's from Supreme, but this one here happens to be from your man Cactus Jack. So many tees from that whole uh, Travis Scott game collab that when it came I forgot I ordered it. You already know if you ever broken Travis Scott everything takes four to six weeks. So this tea right here is the Cactus Jack drink. As you can see here regular tea right there as you shoot to the back astronomical. Now, this tea looks brown to the eye. Could be a charcoal black. <coughs> but this tea is from the Fortnite Travis Scott collab. I also got the hoodie. I wore it already. This is the brand new tea fresh out the package. More Travis Scott. This one is out the package because I was going to wear this. That's why I said, let me hurry up and do this video, man. Right here is your nice blue Travis Scott tee. I don't know if this was, no, this ain't Fortnite. This is actually the LeBron uninterrupted Travis Scott tee for the uh, class of 2020. 
May 16th, 20. And I'm um, big Laker fan. Not that big of a LeBron fan, but big Laker fan. So whenever Travis Scott and LeBron get together, you know I'm going to get it. But I really brought this tee because the baby blue and the fire red matches my Travis Scott force perfectly. Class of 2020, congratulations. There's another package. And I believe it's from Travis Scott, too. What's up? Yep. This one here, I don't know if it's gray or chalk or black neither, man. I have to put it under the UV light. And this one is kind of busy. It sure has a lot going on. So the front has the Travis Scott Fortnite look. And the back has looked like some speakers, some music, a whole bunch of stuff going on. What I really like about this tee is that it's not just printed on. A little closer. It actually has that 3D pop-out look like a new era fitted. Scott. And this here is your Fear God Essentials. I went crazy on the Essentials. I wore most of it because it's essential. And what I mean by essential, it's just comfortable, man. Like, it's just an everyday throw on. But this right here is a t shirt that's a medium but looks huge. <laughs> This tee looks huge, but this is the Essential Fair Guard uh, medium black tee. The letters are black also, so it's kind of hard to see maybe, but they do pop out in 3D fashion, as you can see. Um, I think, yeah, I got it all from PacSun, or PacSun. I never really know how to pronounce that. That's Essential Fair Guard. Last but not least, another essential piece that I didn't wear yet. I hope this ain't huge neither, but it's heavy. This is the hoodie in the, uh, I guess the gray color. Um, I make a pull these off with my oatmeal's. Not too sure, but I def I got the triple black ones too, so. This might fit with the triple black joint. Fair Guard Essentials. I mean, shout out to you if you're a subscriber. If you're not, hit that button down there below. Looks like a Supreme Box logo, but it says subscribe. Um, being that I brought so many uh, shirts from Supreme Week 1, ended up with a whole bunch of gloves. So um, I'm giving out two pairs of gloves. Just comment in the section below um, your Instagram, um, your Instagram handle, and I'll hit you on your DM and um, give you the address. The first two to comment will get a pair. So um, at fast, man. Later this day or maybe tomorrow, I'll show you my review on the Jordan One Satin Snakes. Again, I know I've been slacking, but don't think your boy ain't been copying, cause I've been copying. Just getting getting behind this camera is just. It's been a lot, man. So um, I'm your boy Sneaking Notes. Thanks for checking in. Be back soon. Everybody, get rich.